What's good, y'all? Shout out to Notification Gang for hitting the like button. And if you didn't even start yet, y'all have released once. And I appreciate you anyway. Diddy. It's, it's, it's about that time, man. It's, it's, it's about the time. Hey, real quick, man. Shout, shout out to one of, one of my homegirls, man. I, I, you know, I, I didn't get permission to say her name, so I'm not going to say it. But uh, but shout out to her because she's the one who basically sent me all this. Me and her was texting last night back and forth or whatever the case may be. Um, you know you know what I'm saying? Having, you know, whatever conversation we was having. And so she told me about what was going on. I was like, wait, what? She was like, yeah, you ain't heard, man. Like, this, that, 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 that. I said, Damn. So she's sending me YouTube links, she's sending me videos, she's sending me articles, she's sending me all this, that, and third. So y'all already know what time it is, so shout out to her, man, um, you for, for sending it to me, because I, I, this literally flew, uh, flew under my nose. But anyway, uh, so so real quick, one of the articles she sent me, man, I, you know, I was reading it back and forth. Um, it's on USA Today, and I'll make sure to put that article in the, uh, the article link in the description, so y'all can go ahead and read that whenever y'all get a chance to. But again, shout out to USA Today. Uh, it's titled, Sean Diddy Combs Accused by Cassie of Sex, uh, traffic and then the r word and other uh abuses in lawsuits right i had to be made i had to make sure i'd be very careful how I, how i word this man because youtube will flag it um it was literally well i'm gonna try to drop it today but it was published yesterday literally yesterday at um you know november 16th i'm gonna try to drop it today on the 17th today today's friday right uh so that, let's get into it uh sean diddy combs is facing allegations of sexual assault and and physical abuse by ex-girlfriend cassie uh, Cassie's real name is Cassandra Ventura, uh, filed a sex, uh, traffic and other assault lawsuits against Combs in the U.S. District Court for the Southern District of New York. According to, uh, to court documents obtained by USA Today, uh, the singer is also suing Combs Company's Bad Boy Entertainment, Bad Boy Records, Comb Enterprises, LLC, as well as Epic Records. God damn. God damn. And my whole thing is real quick, y'all. My whole thing is that that kills me the most is apparently this has been going on for a while. Now, again, I, I had no idea. I mean, we heard rumors about him doing inappropriate activities with, with, with certain women and and sometimes men, too. Um, but, you know, people always try to make joke of it or light of it, whatever, whatever case may be. So I didn't even think it, I didn't even think it was real. A lot of these things that was happening and going on in the early 2000s, y'all, again, I'm a 90s baby. I was in elementary school when a lot of this stuff was happening. So obviously, you know, I didn't know anything about this or heard anything about this. I'm in elementary. You know what I mean? Um, but allegedly, Diddy offered her $30 million to keep her mouth closed, and she turned it down. So round of applause to uh to, to miss cassie for for, for 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 sticking to her morals um and not and not a damn paycheck because i know a lot of people that would have took that 30 million hell i know a lot of people that would have took three hundred thousand. <laughs> you know what i mean but uh allegedly he offered her 30 million dollars to keep her mouth closed and to not uh disclose certain information in, in her upcoming book that's supposed to be coming out soon um and she turned it down so shout out to her so you know um just wanted to put that out there real quick uh, the complaint alleges that cassie who began a professional and sexual relationship with the rap module um Diddy, when she was 19, was uh, trafficked, R word, and um, attacked by Combs over the course of a decade. Quote, after years in silence and darkness, I am finally ready to tell my story and to speak up on behalf of myself and for the benefit of the women who face violence and abuse in their relationships. In quotations, uh, Cassie said in a statement with the expiration of New York's adult uh, survivors act fast approaching it became clear that this was an opportunity to speak up about the trauma i have experienced um and that i will be recovering from for the rest of my life now again you know my whole thing about this is is everything is slowly but surely starting to come together i remember hearing stories about how diddy made her like shave one side of her head how diddy made her do this that and third now uh, uh, allegedly let me say this allegedly Ain't nobody about to sue me. I'm broke. <laughs> uh, allegedly, um, Diddy will bring people over and 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 make them sleep with her or do sexual activities with Cassie as a as a means of you know friendship or or, or business or to close business deals and stuff like that. And people was like, oh well, well, well she was willing. To, I'm like, no, bro, that that sounds like a form of trafficking to me. I, I mean, I could be wrong. 
I could be wrong. I'm always open to the possibility of being wrong, but that is not right. You don't sit there. First of all, this is your, you know, I mean, y'all, y'all, y'all know how, how these celebrities move quote unquote girlfriends. They're not really girlfriends, but you know, you're supposed to be a, a, his girlfriend. Why, why the hell are you giving your girl to another damn men to other men as a form of friendship, as a form of, Oh yeah. See how far that head is or some stupid crap. Like, bro, what? That's insane. That is insane. I'm, I'm going to read a little bit more, y'all, but I, I just, I just, I just want to talk to y'all real quick because it's, it's just, I, you know, me personally, I just don't understand it when it comes to situations such as this. Um, I, I really want to know what was going on. It, it was, is this like an, another R. Kelly situation where she was held against her will or something like that? Like, I'm trying to figure it out because a lot of these, because if that's honestly and truthfully the case, or maybe not the case, if that's the, uh, the case, then what's going on with young Miami young Miami is basically his you know and I said this before y'all young Miami is basically did his bed wetter all this that and the third uh I mean bro this man made her look so damn stupid on, on, on her own podcast show I mean it's not really hers it's Diddy's but <laughs> uh on her quote-unquote own podcast show what was young Miami saying yeah we go together real bad he was like oh no nah, we ain't well man we don't go together we not officially together no nah, we cool we this we vibe we go out and she just kept pushing the topic. Yeah, but we together though. We 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 together, but we not together. Like we, we, we like just looking dumb as hell. Looking like a true uh, what, what's the PC word I'm looking for? Escort. Looking stupid. So again, I, you know, and, and I'm a, I'm going to put a question out there. How far, um, ladies, fellas, Sue? How far is it that um, that women will allow this man to go just to say, "Hey, I'm next to Diddy. Hey, I'm with Diddy. Hey, I'm a, I'm dating. Or I'm I'm his girlfriend, or whatever the case may be." How far are they willing to take it? Because if they're going to be able to take it to the extent of, like, for example, Young Miami, when situations like this happens and things go south and you're no longer on the, you know, the record label or whatever the case may be, then a lot of the times you shouldn't even be able to speak on whatever happened because. A lot of people are going to say, hey, listen, this was consensual or was not consensual. In my opinion, I don't think this was consensual. In my opinion, I don't think this was consensual. Do you think, uh, I'm going to put up another question. Do y'all believe that everything that was happen happening to Cassie, do y'all you, do think that this is the same thing as happening to Young Miami? Let me keep going. Uh, anyway, Cassie met a 37-year-old uh Sean Combs in 2005 after the rap model yeah that, that that time bro I was literally six I was in sixth grade to oh five sixth seventh grade uh after the rap model uh became interested in signing her to bad boy records after being lured into an quote uh Austin Tate yeah I know I cannot read ostentatious fast-paced and drug-fueled lifestyle in quotation and a romantic relation relationship with Combs Cassie alleges in a lawsuit that Combs took control quote unquote uh, of her life, ranging from her health care to her career opportunities, and uh, plied her with drugs and alcohol. Mr. Combs asserted complete control over Ms. Ventura, uh, Ventura's uh, personal and professional life, thereby ensuring her in an uh, ability to escape his hole. The filing, um, yeah, so that, well, that was one of the questions I was asking. So I was like, yo, is it an R. Kelly situation where they have her hold, held hostage? So I guess so. It, it technically was a... Um, it technically what what was was a uh, a situation such as that. And my next question would be, where is her parents? Who like who who really loves this woman? I will be damned if I will, I don't have any kids yet, but I'll be damned if I will allow my 19 year old uh, daughter to be running around with a 30 grown 30 40 year old man. What the hell do you got going on here? What do you have going on here? Again, let's keep going. Obedience and sil uh, silence were also expected of Combs' uh, staff and employees at Bad Boy Entertainment, Cassie alleges. Although Combs was prone to uncontrollable rage and frequently, uh, you know, attacked Miss Ventura savagely in the presence of Combs' teams, the, uh, the singer claims nobody challenged their frightening and ferocious boss. Yeah, of course not. That, that's usually what, 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 what tends to happen. So again, y'all, the, the, uh, this article keeps going and going. Um, I'm, again, I'm going to put the article in the link you know, the article link in the description so y'all can go ahead and read the rest of it. Um, a lot of this stuff, again, like I said, bro, a lot of this stuff was happening in early 2000s. I'm in elementary, middle school. You know what I mean? Like, it, this this, this is crazy. A lot of the things I've heard as of recent 
as far as him and Usher and and and, and Exhibit and uh, Justin Bieber and, and all the rest of these people, B5 and all of them. Like, yeah, we heard of those things happening and going on allegedly, right? But, you know, it, it's, it's just to a point where now it's coming to the front. So all in all, what can we learn from this, man? Hey, Diddy, it's only a matter of time, man. You better get your affairs in order. You better get your affairs in order. Honestly, and if I'm being brutally honest, y'all, I don't think this is going to be resolved anytime soon, man. I, I think because, you know, the, the type of money that, that Diddy got, man, is this this will be prolonged for at least another three to five years minimum. I would be shocked if, if first of all, an arrest warrant is issued by, by the end of the year, let alone within the next three months. I would be shocked as hell if an arrest warrant was issued. I would be shocked as hell to see him behind bars. Within the next three months, I'll be shocked to sell. I honestly think it's going to happen eventually. I just don't think it's going to happen now. Because I tell y'all all the time, justice, it typically goes towards the person that has the most money. Uh, as far as Cassie, I hope you win these lawsuits against all, all of Diddy's LLC business companies and all this, that, and the third. Uh, I hope you win all of these lawsuits. Um, and, and you get and, and you get more than thirty million dollars of what that was originally offered to you by uh, by allegedly by um, Sean Combs, Mr. Diddy. Um, I, ho I hope you, I hope it's three hundred million. You know what I mean? I hope it's a billion. I hope it's three billion. You know what I'm saying? Because all of this crap that was uh, that was happening to you, bro, is crazy. I've been reading articles. I've been seeing videos. I got, I got more reactions coming, so you already know what time it is. Just be patient with me. Um, but I've been reading a lot of these articles and, and I mean, bruh, some of these allegations going back since 2000, since the nineties. Nah, bruh, nah, 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 nah. Uh, but maybe I think differently, man. I want y'all to comment down below. Let me know what y'all thought about this video, man. Thanks for watching. Please, 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 if you haven't, hit that subscribe button, man. Also, too, hit that bell symbol side. Same time you upload, notification will pop up and alert you. Also, too, make sure you hit that like, make sure you hit that share. I look forward to reading all your comments, if any. So, until next time. Please, man, I'll be safe for a